We are on a quest to find the best video host platform for your online courses and your exclusive videos inside your membership website. In this video, we are going to compare two of the top video host services, YouTube versus Vimeo. Welcome to sharingyourpassion.com. You might want to subscribe and be notified because there's a lot more fresh videos coming as a result of my year-long research on what successful online business people have done. It's my mission to share these tips, techniques, and tools with you so you can succeed with your passions and your online business sooner rather than later. This is my blog page comparing YouTube versus Vimeo. Of course, everybody knows YouTube. It's the most popular video service around by far and about 2 billion people use it every day. Let's go through the pros or the advantages of using YouTube. Of course it's free because it's based on an advertising model. It's only second to Google in internet for the most traffic and searches. It gives you the potential for your content to go viral. It's truly a social media platform where you can engage with your audience through the comments and the likes and the shares. The video player is compatible with most browser systems and screen sizes. So those are the pros. And now the cons or the disadvantages. It's not a professional solution for serious online course creators or experts who want to keep their content, their videos private and exclusive. And yes, it will show ads. And at the end of the video, YouTube will recommend other video links whether it's some of your other content, your other videos, or your competitors' videos. So it's going to lead them outside your website or your course. So that's not good. Let's go to an example of how YouTube is embedded in, say, a blog post. This is a blog page or a video blog page in my website. It's a tutorial on a video editor, DaVinci Resolve, on tracking moving objects. And this is the video I created for YouTube and I've embedded it into this blog post. So this is fine because I'm trying to bring in traffic. I'm trying to generate traffic and YouTube is really great for that because there's billions of people on the platform. So I'm using YouTube as a marketing tool to reach out and create content, free content to give value to people in my particular niche so I get visibility and they come in view my videos and they also come in into my blog space. The problem is there's all these distracting things people can do. They can say watch later, they can share it with other people. And if this is an exclusive online course, you don't want it shared. And also if they click YouTube here, they're going to end up in your main YouTube video, which is this. And then they're going to see all these other competitive videos. Some are mine, this is mine. This is mine, but all these aren't mine. And do you really want your audience or your students to find other content that's not yours? Maybe it's a more successful competitor who has more views and more subscribers. So it's not what you want to do if you're creating an online course, especially if you're charging for it. It's just not that professional. It's okay to start with maybe the first few months because you have no budget. But in the long run, if you're a serious course creator, you don't want to use YouTube for your courses, except for marketing value. You can create free short courses so that you can draw in people, get attention and visibility through the ecosystem that is YouTube. That's fine. But for your main courses, the courses you want to charge for, you really need an alternative. All right, so now let's take a look at Vimeo. Vimeo is one of the top leading professional video platforms. It's for people with an online business, it's for small companies, or even medium-sized companies. It's easy to use. So let's go through Vimeo's pros or advantages. From what I've researched and seen, Vimeo is the most affordable professional video platform that doesn't rely on ads. The upgraded plan starts at $7 a month. That's really affordable because there are some other competitors to Vimeo that starts off close to $100 a month. It has a predictable pricing plan based on storage. 
and it has unlimited bandwidth, meaning people can watch your videos as much as they want, even if you're really popular. You're not going to be charged for any kind of overage bandwidth use. Another pro is that it has domain locking embedding, which means your exclusive videos cannot be shared or downloaded. The disadvantages or the cons of Vimeo is that it lacks some of the customization options of pricier video hosts. And it doesn't have HLS encryption for high level anti-piracy. HLS encryption is a type of privacy feature which makes it almost impossible for anybody to download your video. Let's take a look at how Vimeo looks like in a course. So this is a Vimeo video. The only problem this was created on the free Vimeo account and there are some elements that show up that you can't control like this, the title, the icon, avatar, the like, um, watch later and share. And it also shows the Vimeo logo here. Um, so this is what you get when you're using the free version of Vimeo. And now let me show you what a paid version of Vimeo looks like. Okay, this is a video after I upgraded my Vimeo account to the Plus, which is only $7 a month paid annually. So with that, I was able to hide these other buttons, these icons and title and the sharing, the heart. With the Plus plan, you can also hide the Vimeo logo. It's gone now, so this looks generic. So it's nice and clean. Remember earlier as one of the pros for Vimeo, it has domain embedded locking, which means once you turn it on, you can only embed these videos in the domains you list. And I set sharingyourpassion.com as one of the whitelisted domains. And so it plays here. But in another domain I own, I tried embedding it in there and it's not whitelisted in Vimeo and it wouldn't play that video. So only this website, sharingyourpassion.com, can play these videos. So that's a really good privacy protection feature for your exclusive videos. That was really important for me when I was deciding with which video host to go with. This is the Vimeo pricing page. Vimeo has given me the opportunity to offer a 25% discount to my viewers. So if you go to the description section below, I will link that offer where you can get 25% off. And if you click that link, you might see something like this. It might default to the Vimeo business, which is $50 a month. But if you click my link, you might be able to get it for $37.44 per month. That's 25% or more discount off. And if you don't want the business plan, just click here, compare plans. And it takes you to the pricing page at full price. But if you click whichever you want, say we want the plus option, then click purchase now. Then it'll show you the 25% or more discount. So with my link, it'll bring the $7 per month down to only $5.25 per month. So check the description for that link. Okay, so who wins this battle between YouTube and Vimeo? The winner is Vimeo. Why? Because for the purpose of this study, in which we are researching the best video hosting platform for our online courses or our exclusive videos in our membership site, Vimeo meets more of our needs than YouTube. YouTube's a great platform to create a channel for yourself and even do tutorials. It's great for marketing, to bring in free traffic to your content and to your websites and blog. You can certainly use YouTube as a video platform for your, say, mini courses or your free courses. But in terms of professional courses where you're charging people from 10 to 50 to 100, 200 or even more, dollars to access that exclusive video or course, you don't want it on a YouTube platform. You want it in a professional private video platform like Vimeo. Vimeo will not show any advertising at all and it will not show any links to other videos and competitors outside your course. And Vimeo has that much needed domain level privacy which means you can rest assured your video courses can only be viewed from your website and cannot be shared. And that's why Vimeo for me is the winner and is actually the best video host platform out there. And of course, Vimeo is quite affordable. So all of this means to me, Vimeo is the winner. And that's why I actually chose it. And I'm going to use it for all my courses in the future so I can keep them exclusive. And for people like coaches, teachers, authors, 
content creators, Vimeo can do the same for you.